So I've been racing a lot, a lot. <laughs> it's been great. Uh, I have reached the Porsche menus, and we are uh, trying to beat these other Porsches, and I've been struggling. Oh, my God, I've been struggling. Cars hard to control, spinning out the corner a little bit on me, uh, just to the point that I couldn't finish first, second, or third, not even close. So I had to start tuning. So you got to have it to 650 pp, um, and I just couldn't figure out what to do. So I started fooling around with some stuff, and I started getting it to where it wouldn't spin out as bad, still wasn't competing. I mean, these guys are beating me like by 30 seconds between me and first place. So, I mean, I'm running ninth. You know what I mean? Five laps. That's a long race. Finish ninth. So we started doing some research. So let's take a look at how it went, and then we will discuss how we got there and what it took. So we just won this car, but we're not going to be using that one. We're using the Porsche 911. Right here. So let's see how it goes. Now that I did my tuning, made some adjustments, painted my car blue, it was white. That has nothing to do with it. Put some new rims on it. That had nothing to do with it either. I mean, I drove the absolute dog snot out of this car, too. I'm racing as hard as I can. This is probably one of the hardest races I've done so far, competitive-wise. It's a good race. Hope you guys hang in here and we'll get to battling. These AI are really good. I mean, it really challenged me quite a bit on this race before it's over. Kind of went with my Tennessee Titans blue on my Porsche today. Got a metallic blue, it's actually a light blue. Drag race to the corner. She handles so good. What a huge improvement with the changes that I made. But will it be enough to get it done? I mean, this is no give me. This was a hard race. Look at those two cars. Do you see a difference in them? Yeah, I went, when I come out here, I didn't have a wing on my car for a long time, and I just didn't notice it. Uh, but by adding a wing and adding the uh, effects on the rear, they're under the exhaust. That was a huge part of my setup, but I did go in and make some changes in the uh, transmission as well, and I'll show you the settings at the end of this race. <clears throat> but you will want to add a wing, and you will want to add this. I can't think of what those are, baffles that's in between the exhaust on the back. We hit that guard in the rear end right there, so there went our clean drive up on us. So. All bets are off now. <clears throat> Gloves are off. It's all about completing the task at this point. Got a little damage on the front right of the car right there. You got to finish third. It starts you in 16th. And these cars get stretched out. So you really got to run them down.
and it is not an easy task, as you will find out here later on in this race. You get up here with these front runners, they get busy. throttle. That wing has got a lot of grip, a lot of downforce. Keeps that rear end nice and stable. I think those baffles in the back actually help with that too. Do the turns. watching I was like <clears throat> hell those cars all got wings that's one of the differences between me and them Got to get around. We are giving it hell down through there. Wide open. that apex stay in tight on that one nice and tight all the way around came out a little bit wide Pushed him a little wide. They ain't done with me. They ain't gonna be no give me. Well, right on them again, though. Let's see if we can get this pack of three. Get a little slipstream action going. Hot. 
do what you gotta do to get past this mission. I've drove it a lot. Hell, I'm blocking. Watch, I block them before it's over. I just bought an Amiga RX 7 and 42 and 4. Hey, let me turn on my messages. Let's see what you're saying. Porsche. Oh yeah, RX-7 fully tuned. It's nasty. This whole game's nasty. I've had a big time with it. I mean, these cars come out, they're, they're gonna battle me. They're not done. Oh, hit the curb. <laughs> they're all over me again. <laughs> Battling back. Are we still in at third? I've been driving a fire out of this car. <laughs> Have you passed this part yet? hat and get you a wing. Put those baffles on the back end. It's a battle. <laughs> oh, this is a battle, dude. I bet I drove it ten times. Five laps, right? That's 50 laps I put in here and I ain't beat them yet. And I just realized I went back and watched the replay and I'm like, well, every other car's got a wing but mine. Oh, grocery store. Grocery shop. That's nice. Okay. You don't have to go today if you don't feel like it. I can go tomorrow. Oh yeah, Blue Moon. That was a hard one. If I'm not mistaken, we're in third now. Oh yeah, downforce matters. That wing made all the difference here. They're going to battle back. I'll have to deal with that little orange car before it's over with, if I'm not mistaken. Best I can recollect. I bobble. There's where I go off the track a little bit. I get all discombobulated here for a second. Off the track right there. and got excited. <laughs> Car looking rough. Front nose took a beating. shift
Here they come. Oh, off the road. Close in a little closer. That uh, went down. So we got a third out of that. I'm gonna show you guys what my settings were to get that. So that was spa. Bear with me one moment. All right, so we enter that. Car settings, racing soft tires, and then uh, I changed these two things here: uh, natural frequency, 260 and 230. Do you need to set them on? Uh, check your cameras too. One and one five. I think I changed on those. Uh, downforce, I don't believe I changed anything on that, but you can check it and see. 110, 230. Full control computer to 74. Power restrictor all the way down to 70. Right here's the big one. Uh, change your uh, performance adjustment on your transmission to 330. I have a semi, oh, I'm sorry, sports racing filter, air filter. And taking exhaust the semi racing, or I'm sorry, muffler semi racing, exhaust manifold racing, brake sport, brake pads racing, handbrake normal, front rear balance is three. There's the things that I've installed on this car. Check that out. So you want to do that. Then you want to go add the wing and add the baffles in the back, and you do that in GT Auto. Change your oil while you're in there, too. Maybe even give your car a car wash. So that's the settings. That's what it took to get her done. And that was third place. I've worked hard to get that third. Uh, so we don't want to race that. And again, we've already done it. <clears throat> it's 7.30. So right now I'm working on trying to complete my menu book. I know here it was raining last time I went to that. So we're going to go to this one next. 650 or less. This car will work. Yeah, I just took it in there and started playing with it, dude, on the natural frequency to, to the uh, time, trial, time, trial, uh, time trial track and just started turning laps. Move it back and forth and see where it worked. I went all the way down. It felt okay. I went all the way up. It felt so much better. I thought, oh, hell, let's move the other one up. Moved it up. Ta-da. Yeah, it seems like it's hiding in that natural frequency. And what was happening is I was coming through the turns and I would spin out. I was oversteering a lot. That's what solved my oversteer. That and the wing. And of course, I finished third, so there is some tuning that could be done still. Oh, yeah, I feel it. Big time in my wheel. What the hell the difference between spinning out and not? <laughs> you just feel more control coming through that turn. So it's fine tuning adjustments. Whoopsie, oh, almost oversteered there. But it's easier to recover now that I put that wing on. And adjusted that frequency. 
and raise the transmission up. I mean, basically, I just had too much damn power coming through the turn. You know, when you get on the gas right here, it'd be too much to spin the car around. Let's so stretch it out a little bit. Now she's faster on the long run. And not as fast through the turns, but not as much power through the turns. She's faster because I'm not spinning out. Less is more. Mr. Gear there. I love that turn. Throttle management. Well, throttle management off the throttle till it settles. The shit out of this car. That's <laughs> badass now. Oh, touch that grass. It's so good. Yeah, tower. Oh, yeah, power me. Oh, contact. Oh, break, 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 or don't get out of control. We're not looking to do another five laps. Three cars to get around, two laps to do it in. Oh, battle at me. Got to go. Just out braked him. He 
Fuck. Oh, oh, don't fuck up. Oh, there it comes again. Oh, don't wreck. Go, go, go. He's battling. They definitely get harder the further in the menu books you go. Fly it in hot. A good turn. Oh, out of control. There it went. Shit. Ah. Uh. Oh. That might be all zero, folks. <laughs> I don't know if you're going to beat it now. One spin out could do it. I got it. He's pulling away from me. I may have to go do some more tuning. See a car up there going through the turn. It's P4. One and a half laps to go. Reset. I'm toast. Get a reset. It's over. Not gonna beat him this time. <laughs> it's just freaking hard. I think I got to tune the car a little bit more. Get more out of it. She feels so good though. I truly feel like the things that have more driver error. One lap to go, three spots to make. Lady ain't singing yet. She's tuning up though. Oh, 
I think I should have been around that other car by now, though. Same. It's gonna be that close. Oh, so close. Can't you see anybody? All right, guys. So, put the wing on. <laughs> we'll be back. Peace. Was close. We'll get him. <laughs> 